Well, when Miss Mill made the formal complaint, you see, I thought we'd find some witnesses. But we can't find any, not so far. And there's them two saying that I hit them. There's the one backing them up, so... What about him? The man on death duty that night. Tell me about him. Well, just another copy, you know, to drag me into Andrew Road cop shop and he's beyond the desk, that's all. What did he say? Oh, well, nothing much. Well, first off, he tried to make them just let me go, but... Did he? Oh, yeah, but then one of them went off into a room with him. When they came back, he was agreeing with them and I got charged. Yeah, what was he called, you know? The man on desk duty. Did they say his name? Oh, Harry. They just said, hello, Harry. And they were grinning at him somehow. Can I talk to you for a minute? Look, um... I won't waste any time. We've lost the witness, Mrs. Meller. She's changed her mind, withdrawn her statement. Could you do that just like that? Now, I've tried to explain it to her, and I'll have another go tomorrow, so... Oh! I know it's rotten news, Raymond, but... Does she know what that does to me? I tried to explain to her, and I'll try again tomorrow. It's bloody hopeless. Now, don't panic, Raymond. Not yet. We're not giving up. Not yet, we're not. The complaint could still be investigated, and I'm going to start a civil case against them for compensation. Honestly, Raymond, we've not lost yet. Can I give you a lift, yeah? No, thanks. I'll walk. Yeah, I can hear movement. There's somebody in there. Can you try it again? We want to talk to you. Will you open the door, please? Get lost! Oh. Is Nazarene Shah there with you? Come on, Errol, don't be silly. Is she there or not? I don't know, no, Nazarene! Yes, you do. Now stop playing games. We want to help you. Look, Errol, we know about the drugs. That's a very serious business, and if you're holding Nazarene against her will... I told you, there ain't no Nazarene here! You do know she's underage, don't you? What with that and the drugs, you could be in very serious trouble. Oh, well, better down the toilet and down somebody's throat. You stupid cow! They're all wait! Where are you going? Morning. Morning. Morning, sir. Don't look down. But that's the one. The big one. Who? What, the one who did Taj? Yeah. What's your reckon? Let's get him. No. There's the rest of the gang. Well, so what? Let's get some of the others. Come on. No, we leave it to the committee. You what? Committee? Are you mad? You don't mean the club, Mick. The Asians have got their own set up, like vigilantes, right? It's called the Defence Committee. You should see it. It's like flipping Scotland Yard in there. Maps and dates for tax. They've got files and all that lot. Well, they will have after last night, right? Don't worry. They'll get what they deserve. Vigilantes. Hey. You put the cash box. It's not there in the cabinet. It was before the meeting. I know, but it's not there now. I've looked everywhere. It's gone. Oh no, it's about fifty quid all the subs. Didn't you lock it? I thought so, but I can't have. Oh, come in, Mick. No. Oh, thanks a lot, Mick. Very helpful. That's all right, Arlene. Don't worry about it. Just a little nip of damage on me From that thing that underneath that zip I can be lots of fun When you step a little older You'll understand that every woman in the world Loves a big black man Oh, but the moon, I'll get back and let a man do the popcorn.
pistol right now. <laughs> I want you guys to stop calling me no now. No, thanks, boss. Horse is a nickname. I'm too old for nicknames. So, you want us to take our shorts off? <laughs>